What are your thoughts on OBJ and Aaron Rodgers? Hi, this is Coach Jim Johnson. Do you cut athletes some slack? If you follow the NFL at all, or even sports in general, you probably have seen Odell Beckham Jr. and Aaron Rodgers making headlines. Aaron Rodgers recently tested positive for COVID after lying about his vaccination status earlier in the season, while Beckham used his social media to force his way out of Cleveland, ending up with the Los Angeles Rams. How do you react when you see pro athletes acting erratically? Do you cut them any slack? Do you hold them to a higher standard? In this video, I will give you my thoughts on both of these situations and what it says about each athlete. Rodgers, he's the current quarterback of the Green Bay Packers and reigning NFL MVP. Aaron Rodgers has stated multiple times that he is immunized and led people to believe he is vaccinated. After not following protocols and creating a big stir last week, he tested positive for COVID and is now coming forward that he is in fact not vaccinated. This whole story shows arrogance and selfishness of Rodgers. He thinks he's above his teammates and the rules do not apply to him. The lack of humility and honesty here, while not surprising, is very disappointing. Beckham. Odell Beckham Jr. now has a new home with the Los Angeles Rams, but not after making some headlines. A few weeks ago, his father posted a montage video on Instagram displaying the times that when Beckham was open, but was not throwing the ball. This created the notion that he wanted out of Cleveland and was ultimately released, then signed this week. The distractions came along with OBG were not worth it for the Browns, and he is a great example of addition by subtraction, as evident by a couple weeks ago when Cleveland beat the Cincinnati Bengals 41 to 16. How about integrity? Both players lacked integrity and ultimately became a distraction. Rodgers will continue to be the, with the Packers for now, while OBJ has a new home. Always remember that no one is bigger than the team. How about character? More important than talent, both exhibited poor character and proved that their core values did not align with those as a team in a whole. Does your individual character match with the core values of your team? So let's learn from both of these professional football players and let's step up and be better, be people of integrity and do the right thing every single day.